source hate does not metastasize across the country. And the way we express our concerns is, first of all, having our commander-in-chief speaking out forcefully, directing his attorney general to respond forcefully with every prosecutorial and investigatory resource at his disposal, at his disposal, and most importantly, modeling the kind of country we want this country to be. You know, in the midst of all of this, uh, Gloria, there were press on Steve Bannon, one of his top advisors to the president, supposedly on thin ice right now. Yeah, but I think that uh, probably has very little to do with this. This is uh, 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 something that predated this. That at the time, uh, uh, Reince Priebus left, there were a lot of there was a lot of talk about whether Bannon would in fact be the next to go, and I think that uh, it's it's unrelated to what we saw in Charlotte. Well, if he were to go, how would that play out in terms of this bigger issue that we're talking about? this rise of white supremacy. A couple of things, Well, First of all, unlike some of the other members of the White House team that the president either has pondered firing or has fired, Steve Bannon has his own sort of base because of his affiliation with Breitbart. And I think one of the considerations in terms of whether he stays or goes is that Bannon could be more harm to the administration if he's kicked out of the administration. In terms of white supremacy, well, I think the issue with Bannon is complicated because he has many detractors and there's a lot of evidence to suggest he holds some of these views. There are a lot of people I have talked to, including people of color that work for Breitbart, that have sworn up and down to me that he is not a white supremacist. Very quickly, Heidi, what's your biggest fear right now? Well, I mean, my biggest fear is more metastasizing violence on this front and a White House that takes too long and hasn't taken seriously how to respond to this. This needs to be on the top of the White House's agenda. Very serious issue right now facing the country. We're going to take a quick break. We'll have much more on the breaking news right after this. I was playing golf a couple of days ago. Uh, 